no! Never mind. That doesn't always work. But here we go. <sighs> Gamma effects. Sure. Oh. No, not the options. Extras. Sun Death Sector 3. Here we go. Remember, attack is your best friend. And of course, since nothing is explosive, strength is too, but I prefer attack here. Well, everything but. I guess we're going by strength here. Oh, oh, oh! Whoa! No! Now that I have level 10 strength, I hope Krotoa doesn't try to mess around with me. <laughs> have any of you guessed what the bosses are going to be like on Sun Death? Original run, which should be a boss run, or no, which should be just Kratoa, basically. Well, um, I've already gotten that ribbon, and ribbons do not appear unless you like collected the ribbon in the sector before it. Meaning, you have to collect sector one for the two to appear. If you Sector 3, then Sector 4 won't appear, and Sector 5 won't appear, and basically so on. Fly away! <laughs> There's an epic death for you. Game freezes while you're just laying there, and then suddenly. <laughs> Sorry if that best bit. Eh, this thing has good recording quality. It has bad sync, but. Attack! Ooh. I can't believe I didn't notice this. Now everything will die fast and painfully. Improved auto loading. My gun reloads faster. Falling. Boom. Blitz. From the ceiling. Kill people to live. Ah, what the heck? Now, watch this. These guys have been giving me too much trouble. Die. And now I can actually. It is no longer sun death, as I can lose one piece of health. I am. Um, I started to draw, I'm sorry. I can lose one piece of health to get teleported back here. It's basically a checkpoint. <sighs> Screw the door! That's what I have to say about it. I just wanted to kill the elite with a shotgun in one hit. 
because it's always fun to do that. It's like, ha ha ha, you are one of the hardest enemies of the game, and I just owned you with a shotgun. Ah, man. Oh, crap. He's gonna... Yep, I knew it. He hit it. But he's still dead. It's too bad. If one dies, the other one dies with him. That was their vow. But, not knowing that it actually happened one day, they died together. What the heck? That didn't kill you? I freaking rock. And the music goes perfectly. Getting my arm. Arm. A bit of a wall burn. you may have learned, that is why you don't only rely on the shotgun. Machine gun is helpful because you can shoot from far away. Now, explosive projectiles are dangerous, but they, um, they shoot from as far away as the eye can see. So, that's why. You can of often you kill yourself while using a sudden death sector and uh, explosive. Not with the nuke. The nuke will kill everything in sight. Die. Well, at least I don't think the out of sync problems are too much. Because, in this game, it kind of fits with whatever you're going to do. Oh, come on. You ask to die? Oh, that was a close call. That's what I mean. Some of these enemies have weapons of mass destruction. This is my favorite part of the game. towards the end. Now, just a side note for everybody. I heard somebody say to keep this guy alive because he's the writer of all the journals about his girlfriend. And the girlfriend, as you've seen at Sector 9, died. So... We're just going to kill it, because that doesn't matter right here. But here is my favorite part of Sun Death Sectors. Kratoa. Just listen to his dialogue. Who are you? I'm going to speak to you. You're that human anomaly. Don't expect me to waste my time with some weakling. You know nothing! Over-violent, the lunatic. Shut up, this planet is ours, so we roll it as we see fit. You should be thankful that this is yours is the last civilized they should ever fall for us. Now die! Screw you. Maybe there's space, please. <laughs> In sun death, 
we took one damage. <laughs> yeah, I'm a failure. Oh well, it works. Now to upload these things. Thank you guys for watching. Bye. Crap, this is still recording.